Another dog park that people in Anderson have been waiting years for is finally welcoming dogs of all shapes and sizes. It's right behind the Anderson County Library. Delay after delay pushed back this opening for months. The biggest holdup was an unexpected fiber optic line under the three acre park. But now dogs and their owners are celebrating big grand opening. In seven years reporter Nicole Ford is there tonight and she's joining us live with the very latest in all this. Nicole. Well, it's quite an exciting time. I can't even tell you, dozens of people along with their furry friends from young to old, they're all here for this exciting time. Now, as you can see, kind of off to my right, the dedication ceremony just getting underway. So they're going to make a few speeches about that uphill battle you just talked about to get to this point. Then they're going to cut a ribbon and the gates will open to unleashing all these dogs into the new park. The sun shines over a quiet patch of grass off Finch Street. <laughs> But soon it will be filled with sounds of dogs having a potastic time at the new dog park in Anderson. Well, we're just happy that we have one close by. Um, you know, we've been waiting on this dog park for a couple of years now. Three and a half years to be exact since the idea first came about in the city of Anderson. It was a bit challenging finding space in the downtown area that was big enough for a park. After trial and error with another location, the spot off Phantom Society Streets near the library was chosen. Yeah, we've gone by this spot. We've kind of, kind of been doing like a little mental di mental diary of it. <laughs> we've seen it, you know, just a lot cleared, and it's like, oh, they put the fencing up. Oh, they've got the parking. <laughs> and so it's, it's it's nice that it's like finally finally going to happen. Now lined with fencing for both small and large dogs, it was a bit of a challenge to get this space cleaned up. And the doors open for the pups. We began the process of, of underbrushing and removing debris last spring, and I think originally 13 dump truck loads of debris were removed. But now complete, you'll find water and waste centers for the dogs and safety lights and cameras for the people. And this outdoor space isn't just a park, but the culmination of a community's desire to enhance the place they live. I think it's nice. It, it gives people a reason to want to come to Anderson. Dog parks brought people together, brought dogs together, enhanced relationships, and I think enhanced the quality of life of communities. Now this new park is a great example of partnerships here in Anderson County from the $100,000 it took to raise by the community to make this all happen from the land being owned by the county to the city who will now maintain it. So this park will officially be open here in the next 15 minutes from dawn to dusk seven days a week. So be sure to bring your furry friends down here to enjoy it. Live in Anderson, Nicole Ford, 7 News.